So, for this video, I will be playing a Mario fan game, which takes the original Super Mario Brothers game and uh, makes it so it's in the style of Atari 2600 games. You know, like, really low bit weight, I think? I think that's the word. So, I'll be playing it and see if it actually feels like an Atari game and a Mario game. So, without further ado, let's play it. Hey, Z is jump. Looking like it could actually play off a original Atari 2600. I don't like the design of the mushroom. It seems too ugly. Not, not cartoony enough. It has too many red spots on it. Feels surprisingly... Like an actual Atari 2600 game. It's really good. Huh. I'm not taking the shortcut. I'm just gonna... Ooh, Fire Flower. The Fire Flower looks the least like something Atari could have made. <laughs> I'll keep a mushroom. I'm so used to seeing it like... When you get hit with a fire flower, you turn into a uh, normal Super Mario. I just keep- because I play Mario Maker 2 way more than the original games. So, I like that touch. And I like the, that animation. I would have kind of wanted it to make the music as well sound like it could have been on an Atari 2600. Because it just kind of feels out of place in a way. Like, act the exact same music from the original, but it looks like it's running on one of the first game consoles ever. It just feels off. Okay, the Koopas are definitely the least Atari-feeling things, but... Like, I, I think it's fine. The only part that really feels like, oh yeah, that's an Atari Koopa, is when they're in the shell, because they're a big square. I like the design of the Goombas. They look way more innocent in this one. Like, in the original, they look angry. Oh, the Piranha Plants look fine. They look... They kind of look like an 8-bit sprite, not, like, an original, like, Atari 2600 one. But so far, this is a really good game. If you just like different variations of the original Mario Brothers, and I really do. That's why I made a bunch of videos on Mario 35. I think this is gonna be the last level I'm gonna play. Okay, that's all I'm going to play for today. I honestly really loved that game. It's a really nice homage to classic Atari games and classic Mario games. It's I really like the designs. Some of them feel like they aren't from Atari, but most of them feel, oh yeah, this could definitely... Like, this game could actually play on an Atari 2600 if they made it on on an Atari 2600 cartridge it it's that uh it's just that good it's it it would be better if it had the VHS filter you can put on things and like video editors because then it would look like it was actually playing off an Atari 2600 because it kind of makes the flaws in Atari graphics seem more noticeable when it's not blurry enough it looks way more kind of bad but, I mean, 
it's still, it doesn't detract from the greatness of this game. I highly recommend it. In fact, this game will be linked in the description. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe for more fun gaming videos like this. And tell me in the comments what Mario fan game I should play. See you in the next video. Bye.